Hey guys, welcome back to uh, Rob's Arcade. My phone's about to die soon, so let's go ahead and uh, let's make this quick. Don't go anywhere. We got a new episode coming right up, so hang tight. Rob's Arcade, Rob's Arcade, where the games get played and the games get saved, so they can be played on another day. Rob's Arcade. All right, guys, welcome back. It is, uh, gosh, February 1st, 2023. It's a Wednesday, so it's new comic book day. We're halfway through the week. And for those of you who've been hanging around for a while, you know, like getting new comics is something I've always done on Wednesday. I've always liked doing these videos with you as well because it just, I don't know. Um, it, it helps uh, like signify uh, the middle of the week. We've made it this far. We've only got a few more days left until the weekend. Hopefully you guys uh, have some some fun stuff planned. I'm going to be working. My weekends are, are kind of a little bit different. They're like during the week. Um, so I'll be working. I love it, though. Uh, just, you know, I really do enjoy uh, my job and the people I work with. And just, it's just a lot of fun, always. Uh, hopefully you guys have been having a good, good week. Good, 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 good week so far. Shit's got me all jacked. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys have been having a good week so far and uh you know you're having a great wednesday it's new comic book day so we're gonna head into my favorite comic shop stories here in uh richmond virginia one of them anyway i also really like uh richmond comics a lot richmond comics and stories are two of my favorite shops here always uh, like coming in here hanging out with alex and uh you know just uh oh gosh i can't think of the girl's name right now it eludes me um but they're just always fun and they're great people. Uh, they they actually know, like their grandparents and them know the owners of um, the restaurant I work at. These you know two Italian families that just know each other really well. And there's this really cool, weird like parallel. <laughs> I can't escape. I go to the comic shop and I see some of these people. I go to Vinny's and I see some of these people. It's really really neat um so anyway, i'm gonna go in and grab some new comics i want you guys to uh hit that comment section for me just let me know how you're doing let me know what you've been up to maybe what you did this past weekend what you got going on this weekend what comic books you want me to pick up who your favorite superhero is whatever just go ahead and hit the like hit the comment section i'm gonna hit the comic shop I'll be back. Oh, there we go. All right. Awesome. Always such a cool visit. So funny. I was like, I can't remember her name. And I walk in and out because we had a whole thing last week. So Alex was like, what's your name? Oh, excuse me. It's not as good, but man, the gas, the farts, it's rough. Let me take some more. Why not? Anyway, take two. So we had this whole discussion about names last week. Scott was what he thought my name was. I thought his name was Alec, not Alex. So I walk in a day and he's like, Rob. And I'm like, Alex. <laughs> and then I couldn't remember her name. I thought it was something with a J, Sarah, Sarah. So I think going forward, we won't forget each other's names, but always such a fun time hanging on there. I got to share a really cool story. In fact, I wish I had time and more power on my phone because I would share this story with you guys now. It's probably a story you might have even heard on other videos, but it's a great one. And um, it's actually a Ninja Turtles based story. Uh, there's a cool little artifact in there right now. And if it's there next week, I'm gonna buy it and we'll we'll do the we'll do the um, the Ninja Turtles story there. Let me readjust here a little bit. Sorry there guys. Uh, so anyway, uh, just a great, great time. Always have a fun, fun, fun um, time at the comic shop. Whenever I go in there, Let's see what we got for the uh, comic shop news. Lady Dark. There we go. Something new. Looks like it's coming out. Got an interview with Eric Radvon, the creator of a new series. Lady Dark. Let's see. From. Uh, let's see. Trying to see who. Barrage Studios, maybe? 
it looks like. So anyway, pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. What what were the French picks this week? What did Robert pick up from the comic shop? What did, what did Rob French grab from the comic shop? Let's go ahead. We'll save. I like to save my independence for the last. Uh, let's see. We'll go ahead and we'll dive into some Marvel here. Uh, we've got Venom 16, uh, Dark Web tie in there. Pretty cool cover there. I've actually picked up a few Venoms. Uh, just trying to keep up with the story. I always do DC tie-ins and crossovers. I never really do the Marvel one, so I figured I'd give this one a whirl. We have the Dark Web Finale, number one. Pretty cool cover again. Kind of like a little... Pretty cool. Like that. Let's see here. Uh, also from Marvel, we've got more Spider-Man action. Some more upside-down action. I didn't even notice this here. we got... A little kissy action going on. Turn it upside down. Cool little rainbow effect there in the cover. And then as we know, Miles has always been about that tagging and the stickers and all that. So we got some really cool graffiti kind of art down in there. I just really like this. So it's kind of like screams, uh, the spray cans and everything. Just kind of screams that Spider-Verse film. All right, let's see what we go Ooh, from DC. Uh, not a whole lot from DC this month. Uh, we do have the Flash One Minute War special. New little saga going on in the Flash universe. I've always loved the Flash. I don't know why. I think it's because maybe he's like involved in police work and solving crimes even when he's not doing a superhero thing, you know? I don't know. Anyway. Uh, this is a really cool book. I didn't get a lot from DC in terms of quantity, but I think quality is going to speak for itself with their uh, Black History Month celebration. It's really cool. DC Power Black History Month. I love this cover. I love the colors. Colors, the cover, all of that, and then it's got a really bold emblem there on the back. This, this would make a great t-shirt or any kind of like stickers, put it on everything. I, just, I love that. I love that, that that power. That's a really cool, it, it screams power to me. Like when I look at this cover, that screams power to me. That's just, that's amazing. Great, great cover. Great, great, great cover. Uh, let's see, I picked up, um, got some Gargoyles number two. I picked up the first issue a while back. I still haven't read it. Uh, I haven't read the Darkwing Duck Disney book either, uh, but these, these are just classic, classic titles. Uh, and I am looking forward to finally getting around to reading them. I've just got so many other books to wait through right now. Uh, if I picked up book number two, I have book number one waiting for me. This was a recommendation from Alex. I'm really glad he did. And then we have uh, this here, this other Gargoyles, The Night Will Never Be the Same. This, this doesn't look like, I have to go home and double check, but I don't think this is the same as the first Gargoyles book I have. This looks a little bit tougher, a little bit darker. And then even the, the art inside looks more old school. This looks like an 80s comic, maybe, reprint. I'm not really sure um, what I'm looking at. I'm going to have to dive into this a little bit. <clears throat> A little bit more. Oh, yeah, here we go. First printing uh, was back in 1995. So I was about 15 years old or so, and that definitely ties into more of how this book, the inside of this book looks. So really cool. Okay, great. So it looks like they have like a, a new series going on here, and then they're doing like some really cool uh, reprints of old, of old issues. Uh, and then finally, from Image Comics, we've got... King Spawn, number what, 19? Yeah, number 19. Pretty cool cover. Always really great covers there. Then we've got uh, The End of the Ant from Mr. Eric Larson there. Always love his books. And then, of course, from Mr. Eric Larson, we have Savage Dragon, number 263. Very cool. What do you think, guys? 
All right, guys, well, tell me what you think. Let me know what you thought of this video, what your favorite book was. If there's any books out there that you read that you're like, oh man, you should check this out next time you're at the comic shop, let me know. I'll give it a whirl. Uh, just love hearing from you guys in general. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your week. Thank you so much for hanging out with me for a little bit. Remember, this is a goodbye, simply to be continued. Until next time, don't spend your quarter anywhere else. And just take care of yourself, take care of each other. Later, guys. Make sure you wear your seatbelt.